Well, with vaccinations happening for this group of school age children, school leaders across the region are calling on the state to release updated guidance on masks in schools. News 12's Nikita Ramos joins us with more. Should vaccinated students continue to mask up in class? Well, that's the question superintendents across our region are asking the state. This comes as vaccinations are on the rise and the holidays quickly approach. We want to be able to return children to as much normalcy as safely as we possibly can. And that's why the Lower Hudson Council of School Superintendents sent a letter to the state asking Priority for specific one, guidelines to possibly to lift or loosen mask mandates in school. As we're starting to progress now with the vaccinations, when will we receive guidance on uh, mask mandates in particular and whether or not we can lift those. A meeting hosted by the council in Mount Kisco brought in Board of Regents Chancellor Lester Young and State Education Commissioner Betty Rosa. We really need a state metric so that every community all throughout the state of New York knows what that metric, that data point is, and there's no guesswork there. Lower Hudson Valley superintendents include those in Westchester, Rockland, Putnam, and Dutchess counties. They're pointing the governor to mask metrics other states are setting for students. Massachusetts has certainly been at the forefront in terms of communication with the schools. In fact, school mask requirements in Massachusetts are holding out until January. School districts there have the option to drop the mandate for those with a vaccine, so long as at least 80% of students and staff are fully vaccinated. The question from the state officials is, is when will we receive guidance uh, that will help us in terms of making those decisions as individual districts? Right now, Governor Hochul says compliance is a priority. Kids must get vaccinated. She also says she will continue to monitor COVID numbers before deciding next steps. In the newsroom, Nikita Ramos, News 12. Thanks, Nikita. So we 